Hello friends, welcome to engineering tutorial. So, in the previous videos, a few videos related to electrical machines, we discussed about the important terms and notations associated with electrical machines and some basic concepts about the magnetic field, okay, the generation of magnetic field in specific in relation to the electrical machines. So in this video, we are going to uh, discuss about uh, the concept of magnetic circuits, okay? So how uh, the magnetic circuit is uh, represented and what are the basic things related to it, okay? And will then correlate it with electrical circuits. Okay, so first, what is a... Uh, magnetic circuit so it is a model okay which is used to describe the behavior of electrical machines okay in the same way we use a electrical circuit to describe the behavior in terms of voltage current resistance etc so we'll use the same concept to represent the behavior of electrical machines so uh, the behavior of magnetic the electrical machines in terms of magnetic circuits okay now we know that uh, in an electrical circuit a voltage or emf let's say it is connected across a resistor r having a resistance value r okay so because of this circuit connection okay when the circuit is switched on a current equals to v by r will flow through this circuit so here the important parameters are the emf v the circuit current i and the resistance r in the same way in a magnetic circuit a magnetomotive force mmf okay connected across a reluctance r okay it drives a magnetic flux through the magnetic circuit okay so here the correlation can be done as the emf or voltage v is same same as mmf the current is the same as the magnetic flux and re the resistance is the same as the reluctance okay so a magnetomotive force drives magnetic flux through a magnetic reluctance okay in the magnetic circuit so the terms associated with a magnetic circuit is first the magnetomotive force so the magnetomotive force in a magnetic circuit is given by let's say we consider this uh, insulated frame across which a number of turns of coil are wound so because of this flow of current a magnetic flux is produced and this is the mmf the magnetomotive force associated with this magnetic circuit so the mmf can be represented in two ways first in terms of current second in terms of reluctance and flux so the first representation the mmf here the represented notation symbols and signs are different so you please notice that the mmf is equal to ni that is the number of turns of coil and i is the current flowing through each turn so mmf is equal to ni the number of turns of coil wound multiplied with the current flow through each turn of coil also the mmf can be represented in terms of magnetic flux and reluctance that is basically it is the product of magnetic flux phi and reluctance r so mmf is phi into r so always pay attention to these symbols they are different from resistance and force okay this is mmf is equal to flux multiplied with reluctance so this is the first representation 
in terms of number of turns of coil and current through each turn this is the second representation in terms of flux and reluctance okay so what is reluctance so the reluctance it plays the same role in a magnetic circuit which a resistance does in a electrical circuit so reluctance is the opposition offered by the magnetic circuit to any flow of magnetic flux through the uh, the, the the conductor okay through the coil so reluctance is the opposition offered by the magnetic circuit to the flow of flux okay it plays the same role as resistance does in electrical circuit resistance opposes the flow of current through an electrical circuit reluctance opposes the flow of flux through a magnetic circuit now the reluctance is expressed mathematically as lc which is the mean path length which we discussed in the generation of magnetic field so you please check out that video first so you understand this in a better way so this is the mean path length we discussed the same figure also in the previous video in the generation of magnetic field which is the periphery of this frame the perimeter in the mid section so this is the mean path length divided by mu into a where mu is the magnetic permeability of the material and a is the cross sectional area of this frame so mu is the permeability is the relative ease with which a material can be magnetized or magnetic flux can flow through it okay so the unit of reluctance is ampere turns per weber this is the unit of reluctance so i recommend you to please watch the previous videos related to important terms and notations and generation of magnetic field before watching this video because there i have discussed all those terms in detail so this is the reluctance mathematical expression mean path length multiplied divided by the multiplication of permeability and the cross sectional area next the reciprocal of reluctance so the reciprocal of reluctance uh, is called as permeance okay now we know that in electrical circuit the reciprocal of resistance is called as conductance similarly in a magnetic circuit the reciprocal of reluctance is called as permeance okay so here these are some basic concepts related to magnetic circuits which we discussed we discussed about the concept of uh, magnetomotive force which drives a flux through a circuit reluctance okay in a magnetic circuit we discussed about the magnetomotive force its mathematical expression the two ways in which it can be represented magnetomotive force is equal to ni that is number of turns of coil and current flow through each turn of coil and through the product of flux and reluctance the so two ways and then we discussed about reluctance its mathematical expression that is mean path length divided by the product of permeability and cross sectional area and about the reciprocal of reluctance which is called as permeance okay so these are some of the basic concepts related to magnetic circuits so i hope you like this video and please subscribe my channel engineering tutorial for more such videos related to electrical electronics instrumentation and communication engineering have a great day Thank you very much.